Hello, Keller Williams, Arizona Living Realty. This is Dustin Runyon, and today I'm going to show you how to post your listings on Craigslist through your eEdge Market Leader site. You're going to log into your MyKW. From there, you're going to go to My Marketing, click the plus sign, come down to Market My Listings. Wait for it to load. It's going to bring you to your dashboard, your back office of your Market Leader eEdge site. From there, you're going to click on Post on Craigslist. It's going to bring up all your listings. I'm using the Vicky Running Teams as an example. From there, you're going to log on to Craigslist.org. And once you actually log on to Craigslist, it's going to bring you to Craigslist.org. We're in Mojave County, so that's what we're going to be posting in. From there, you're going to go to My Account. Click on My Account. If you do not have a Craigslist account, click Sign Up for an Account. Put your email address, these verification words. I can never read them. If you can't read them, use these arrows right here, and it'll give you a new one. Um, once you put that in, it's going to send you an email with a link. Click on that link. It's going to bring you back to Craigslist. You're going to choose a password. Once you choose the password, boom, you've got a Craigslist account. I'm going to go back and post, put in one of my generic Craigslist accounts. And here we are. This is your back, this is your dashboard of your Craigslist account. Um, down here, it'll show all your previous listings that you've posted. If you haven't posted any and you have a new account, you're not going to see anything down here. Um, then what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our eEdge account. And we're going to choose a listing that we're going to post on Craigslist. I'm going to post 4048 North Star Drive. Come over here, click New Post. Boom. Gives you this HTML code right here. Post title. I always change the post title because they give you something very generic. The price, street, city, and state. Now I'm going to go back to Craigslist, and I'm going to get to posting a new posting. And that would happen right here. New posting in Mojave County. So that's where we live. Housing offered. Real estate by broker. And boom. Posting title, specific location, posting description. Exactly what's over here. Title, description, home. So once I get to this template part in Craigslist, I'm going to come back to my eEdge. I'm going to click right here. It's going to highlight the entire code. I'm going to copy it. Paste the code, come back, I'm going to take the price. It's up to you whether you put the price or not, whatever drives more traffic for you. If not putting the price drives more traffic to your site, great if you get more clicks that way. If not, put the price in. Here is your, um, now we're going to copy the address. Again, you don't have to put the address in if you do not want to. Um, it is completely up to you. Then I put Arizona. And I'm going to leave the postal. So here we are. Now, again, like I said, I do not post the post title um, from here. I choose my own. I'm going to put uh, my own title. Specific location, Lake Havasu. So all I do is I put a posting title, specific location, that code that I got from my market leader site, price, I'm going to change the housing type to a home. If it's an apartment, land, or whatnot, just pick the type. Um, then I put my street, my city, and state. And there we are. Here is the, the thing where this is where you really need to listen. With Wardex, they will not let us post their photos on Craigslist. They they only they they will not. It's not an approved site. They will not approve it. With this code, it pulls the photo from Wardex. So you can see this. Click on photo. This code right here will put a photo in the posting. We need to delete this code and add our own photo 
because this photo right here, the photo right here, has the Wardex watermark on it. And Wardex does not allow that for whatever reason. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get rid of this photo. So you'll see the code here, I'm gonna scroll down. I'm gonna highlight click on photo to see more photos because that photo is not gonna be any more, there anymore. So we need, to, we need to delete that as well. And then I'm gonna drag it all the way down where you'll see a JPEG into that last P right here. So the arrow P arrow all the way down to where you see JPEG to the arrow P arrow. I'm gonna delete that, hit enter once, and boom, that photo is now deleted. From there, I'm gonna scroll down here, hit continue. It's gonna bring me where, um, where my street address is. It's gonna ask me if this is correct. I'm gonna say continue, that is correct. Now I'm gonna choose a file. I'm gonna come in here, click here, choose my photo file, which is Northstar. I only put one photo. I don't wanna give them too much on Craigslist because I want them to click on the link. I found that only putting one photo up, they click much more than if I give them 20 photos on there or eight photos or I'm not sure how many photos uh, Craigslist even allows you to put on because I only put on one. Click down here at the bottom right, done with images once your image has loaded and boom, it will show you your posting. See so here the map of where the property is, the photo, our posting title, our description, and this is the link. We want to get them to click on this link, um, which in turn drives traffic to our site, which generates leads. Once everything looks good, and if everything looks good to you, you're gonna scroll down here, click publish. Once you click publish, it's gonna say thank you for posting with us, and boom, you are done. In order to get back to your dashboard, all you have to do is click logged in as, click on your email address, and here it is. And you can see that it says Granite Countertops Beautiful Landscaping. It's in here. That's my post. And then what you're gonna do is come back to your eEdge, click mark as post, mark as posted in list, and you will see North Star is posted today. It'll show you how many site visits you've gotten and how many contacts you've gotten from it. I've, we've, uh, the Vicky Running team has posted this before, so you can see they've had 24 clicks to it and two, two leads that they got from that. So there you have it. That's how you post listings on Craigslist.